are back at North America's largest hot shop to watch 10 exceptional artists push themselves to creative extremes. A Vista man who's been blowing glass for 20 years will compete against the best in the field in season two of the Netflix show Blown Away. It's streaming starting today. Mike Shelbo learned the skill at Palomar College. He joins us this afternoon here on the floor. Mike, thanks so much for joining us. I, the show dropped at midnight. I understand that you stayed up and binged the entire season. What do you think? Are you happy? Uh, I'm extremely happy and yes, guilty as charged. I had to stay up. I couldn't resist uh, not being the, one of the first people to see it start to finish. What was it like to be a part of that? You've referred to it as kind of watching a social experiment. How did it feel to be in there? Was it a real process for you? Uh, I'm a huge fan of reality competition shows, so it kind of was like living out a little dream that I had and I just had a fantastic adventure the whole time and I'm hoping that everybody likes what they see. Can you describe to me some of the challenges you had? It's a competition. How did you compete? What were the tasks? Well, uh, they bring 10 amazing glass blowers together all to compete against each other. And it's a series of timed competitions with uh, set parameters that you have to create your piece of art and then display it in a Judge, judging against each other. So it's a stiff competition. And, and a true art. And I understand it's an art form, as I mentioned, that you learned actually at Palomar College. You had had an interest in art and you found your medium there. Yeah, shout out to Palomar Community College up here in North County. Uh, they have an amazing art program. And one of the things that you can do there is learn to do glass blowing, just the same as what you'll see on blown away. Mike, we, we, we know that it's an art, but uh, we know that glass blowing is an art, but we also understand art is something that helps people get through rough times. And I understand that in your teens, your love of art and cannabis actually helps you get out of a dark place. Yeah, yeah. Um, I had found uh, that self-medicating with cannabis was a big way to overcome my depression and uh, it led to and tied into glass art in a big way once I was able to see the connection. Uh, I was stoked to be in today's paper. You'll find me in the weekend section. If you want to read more about it, there's a great article in there today. All right, I only have about 30 seconds left. What's the deal with the gargoyles? Say that again? What, what, I only have about 30 seconds. What's the deal with the gargoyles? Oh, um, they're goblins, actually. Okay. Here's one that I have. I just caught him recently. Uh, he's a little buddy of mine. And uh, this is just something that I've been into my whole career. I've been exploring fantasy creatures and sculpture and just wanted to, uh, you know, share some of that with the world. So check me out and see a lot more. We will do that. It, Mike Shelbo, thank you for your time. Uh, North County repping in the Netflix show Blown Away, a glass blowing competition dropped last night. You can stay up and watch it all just like our guest did. Thanks, Mike, for joining us. And I hope you won. I know you can't give it up, but I hope you did well. Thanks, Carlo, and uh, stay classy, San Diego. All right, thank you very much.